Good evening, viewers, and welcome to this edition of NTV Sports Page. It's Friday, the 12th of May, and I'm Curtis Morton. In our headlines, O'Shea and Thomas transferred to SK and Patriots, and in our feature for this evening, Masters defeat New Vision in third practice game. We'll take this break, and I'll be right back. Has anyone ever touched you here, here, or here? Well, these are actually bad touches, not good ones. And so if anyone ever touches you in these areas or anywhere else that makes you uncomfortable, you must say no, then go and tell. Say it with me. Say no, then go and tell. This message was brought to you by the Department of Gender Affairs in collaboration with Probation and Child Protection Services, the Ministry of Health, and the Pan-American Health Organization. But I'm back and we start with cricket. O'Shea Thomas has been transferred to the St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots for the 2020 Free Republic Bank Caribbean Premier League. Thomas joins the Patriots from the Barbados Royals after two seasons with that franchise. The Patriots will be Thomas's third CPL team, having also played for his home team, the Jamaica Talawas, from 2016 to 2020. Thomas has claimed 42 wickets at CPL at an average of 24.42 across his 33 matches. The complete squads for the Republic Bank CPL will be announced during the draft show, which will be broadcast at the end of June. Meanwhile, Cricket West Indies is undertaking a thorough bid process for Caribbean countries wanting to host the ICC Men's T20 World Cup 2024, which will be held in the West Indies and the USA in June next year. Following the bid process, the venues will be confirmed on the 31st July 2023. Visits to Caribbean venues that are contemplating submitting proposals to host ICC Men's T20 World Cup 2024 matches started on Wednesday, 26 April. A small team will visit each country to look at the facilities and discuss the pathway to becoming a host country. A similar process will also be followed to identify venues to host matches in the USA. Countries selected will have the opportunity to promote themselves to a global audience of over 1 billion people from all over the world. This tournament will also inject significant investment into the economy of each host nation. We'll take this break and I'll be back with our feature for this evening. You can lower your salt intake by reducing salty foods, removing table salt, and using salt alternatives when cooking. Welcome back, and tonight cricket is in the spotlight. The Nevis Masters played a third practice game versus the New Vision team on Sunday, 7th May. Masters batted first and got to a competitive 136. New Vision, in response, was bowled out for 95. Summarized scores Nevis Masters 136, Sterling Marshall 34, Curtis Morton 26, Duncan Mill 16, Peter Charles 2 for 21, Kimani Nisbet 1 for 21. New Vision 95 all out, Peter Charles 21, Kiman and Isbeth 21. Sterling Marshall had the amazing figures of three wickets for nine runs. Vinny Main had not far behind with three wickets for 11 runs, and Rakish won for seven. Let's take in a bit of the action. So Marshall has started brilliantly. Here he goes once more. Marshall bows to Labode. Labode is struck, that's close! The umpire says not out! That must have been mighty close. Umpire Astro Brown, Oscar Brown had a close look at that. Laborde was comprehensively beaten. And it must have been mighty close. They get a leg by. So, uh, man at coast corner now for Peter Charles. Here's Marshall moves in now to bowl. He's punching it. He has a strong forehand, I can tell you. Now Kelly gets right behind it. On that occasion, Kelly got right behind it. Marshall putting his foot to that ball. They keep telling him not to put his foot to the ball. But it's just a bad habit he has. 
Well, Kelly's talking down there. He, he has a lot to say, Kelly. Here he goes. Marshall loops it up. He's on driving. That was a bit off target there. Mills is in position. The bubbles with it slightly. They're thinking of the second. But it's not on. As the return comes in. Pretty useful over that by Marshall. Good start. Well, it's going to be Rakish to bowl now. To Laborde. Bowls. Laborde is sitting it. Could be out. Venwick Newton is here. Venwick Newton takes the catch. He's gone. Venwick Newton. Good catch. And uh, he walks away. But he has kept his eye on it well. And uh, well taken. Rakish gets the wicket. Well done. Here goes Rocky's balls. Whoa! Ball him! Well, no, apparently Mr. Stumps, um, Simmons was celebrating. But um, the bales didn't come off. I don't know what, what, what went wrong there, but he was comprehensively beaten. So he's going to be Rocky's once more. Move oh, he pulls away. He pulls away. So here goes once more. Moves in now to bowl. Oh, pushing it hard. Pushing it with hard hands. Almost back to the ball. He was in there for a little bit. Dropping well short of the ball in the end though. So here goes once more. Looks like a man who is going to swing hard. He's driving. There's a big wind up and just a gentle push back up the strip to the bowler. Looks like a man if he latches on to him, he's going to go to Sabre. Here he goes, moves in once more. Rocky is swinging and he's off the pad. I told you so. If he if he latches on to one of those, it's gonna go to Saber. But he has missed it. So here's Rocky once more, moving in now to bow shorter. He's just squeezing it out back up the strip to the bowler that ends the over. Here's Marshall moving in now to bowl to Chach as whips it away. He has a strong wrist. There's Tatic store bubbling slightly, but um, controlling it, getting the return in. That's the difference when the fielders are agile and moving quickly. So some of these uh, masters, Fenwick, Newton, Tatic store, they're very quick in the field, very agile. L.Y. Kelly warming up would want me to add him to the list. Oh, that one turned certainly stuck him up there because he was looking for the big shot to the offside the ball spun back on him had him choked here goes marshall bowling off bricks balls he's swinging at that again the wind up is isn't um really showing what he wants to do because the big wind up and then no timing on that it just trickles down to long on they get a single so peter charles has shown that he has a very strong wrist He's a dangerous player. Here's Marshall, loops it. He's swinging into that. But here's a man on it, I think. Wendell might say, well, he takes the catch. Marshall has picked up two. So Marshall has taken the break once more, made the breakthrough, gotten the big fish. Peter Charles goes, and Marshall giving him some talk, saying, you know, I'm the master here. So Sterling Marshall has picked up another wicket. Well caught by Wendell Micey Wallace. And certainly a big difference after Marshall went onto the field. Elroy Kelly showing that he could bring over his arms, giving the captain a bit of a hinty hinty. But um, I don't think um, Joel Simmons is looking his, in his direction. He's giving Marshall some advice, maybe telling him um, you need to bowl a few more like that or whatever he's saying. But there's a lot of chatter there from Elroy Kelly. So it's going to be Marshall. He has really made a difference. Moves in now to bowl flatter. He's hitting it in the air. Somebody, Tatics is getting around. Takes the catch, he's gone. So Marshall is on a hat trick. Marshall is on a hat trick. That's his third wicket. And he could be going for four because he's on a hat trick. Well caught by Curtis Tatics, though. And Marshall has certainly made some waves here. So, one of the little batsmen, um, the, I'm not sure if he's a high schooler, I believe he's a primary schooler. Huh? Primary schooler, but these guys have been playing cricket since they were very tiny and uh, well coached by, well, we're a lot tinier than that. 
Maisie Wallace would have trained him well. Marshall on a hat trick ball, flatter. He's topping that hat trick, pushes it hard down to um, Tatic Store. That ends a brilliant over by Marshall. Well, it's going to be Sydney Newton into the attack. And he'll be bowling medium paces. I notice that here's Newton moving in now to bowl. He's swinging it away. There's nobody at Square Lake that's gone for four. Short ball. Nobody at Square Lake. How come that for real? That's um, a mistake, I think, by Joel Simmons. Nobody at Square Lake. And it's gone for four. Here's Newton moving in now to bowl. That's a better delivery. Looking for the run. Off and running. Rakish trots in. And uh, single is on. So these youngsters can be a little handful sometimes. Very stodgy, very hard to get out sometimes. They have learned to bat very early and play pretty orthodox. Here's Newton, moves in now to bowl. He's solidly in line, just pushes it quietly into the offside. Looks as correct as they come. So it's going to be Newton once more. Sydney Newton, number 22 on his back, moves in now to bowl. He is so he's a little bit squared up on that occasion. The bat handle turned in his hand, but he managed to get bat on it and kept it out. Here goes Newton, moving in now to bowl. Here goes short and too short. There's Newton coming across and putting the boot in it. Here goes once more Newton, moving in now. To ball. He's stroking it again, the youngster. Reaching towards it and just stroking it into the offside. That ends the over. So it's Marshall moving in now to ball. Here he goes. Oh, he's struck on the pad as he has a big swing. Okay. Here he goes. Marshall moves in now to ball. He's oh my goodness. He's almost tucked it onto his thumbs there. Again, a bit bamboozled by the spin of Marshall here. That. Here he goes, moves in now, loops it up, and oh my goodness, he's on the back foot. He's just sticking the back there, keeping it out. Looking very uncertain here now. Here's Marshall, moves in now, tweaks it again, it swings. Somebody's going to get for it. Maybe nobody, maybe somebody, maybe somebody. Oh, it drops between them both. The two best fielders on the field. Both of them raced across and somebody pulled away and the other one pulled away. And now they might have a little bit of an argument. It's Venwick Newton and Tatic Store. The two of them are the two best fielders on the field. Both of them got there, but somehow maybe just thinking, well, look here, I might just collide and pulled away. So he got away with it. Says Marshall now to bowl to the youngster. Here he goes, bowls. The youngster is driving nicely, passes the boot of Marshall. Fenwick Newton cleans up. What are you saying? So, Elroy Kelly giving some advice at the far end. The youngster is swinging, shock on the pad. Marshall looks back. He doesn't shout an appeal. I think he should have shouted his appeal. He just looked back at umpire Brown. And umpire Brown just walks away. That ends the over. Newton moves in now to bowl. He's swinging at that. My goodness, he could work for the windmill. That's a big heave. All three stumps move. Newton beats him here. That's it. Well, he's certainly looking for the big heave here. As Newton moves in now to bowl. He's punching it. Well, who's going to get this? Here the two fielders go again, looking at each other. Okay. <laughs> well, 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 they were looking at each other again. But this time, Benwick Newton covers it. <laughs> and that's the problem when you have two good fielders deep and both of them get into the ball. <laughs> and stopping it in the end, they have Benwick Newton. So Newton now will bowl to the youngster. Here he goes. Moves in now to bowl. He's stroking it nicely, off and running. Benwick Newton is across. Stops it nicely and can't score. 
Here he goes once more. Balls now to the big man. Yeah, swings, hits him on the back leg. But I think outside the leg stump, Newton looks back at umpire Johnson. He's not impressed. Here he goes once more. Newton moving in now to bowl. Here he goes, bowls. This time he's solidly forward. Didn't know he had that in his repertoire. Solidly forward this time. Turns now to bowl to the big man. Moves in now to bowl Newton. Short, he's punching it. Sydney Newton puts his hand, stops it. That's good work. Great work by Newton and looks to hit the stops as well. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, well, well. Looking as sharp as a teenager there, Newton. And that ends the over. Good bit of work. L.Y. Kelly into the attack. Loops it quietly forward, thinking of the single. Sydney Newton waiting for it. Should have been attacking that. Brendan Newton eventually picks it up. So L.Y. Kelly bowling off breaks. Here he goes. Moves in once more. Very experienced. He's hitting it. Oh, it's over the keeper. Dow is chasing after it. Can he pull it in? Um, yes, he can. And uh, one more to the total. Just looping up over the head of the keeper there on that occasion. Okay. Still trying to figure who has gone off. Because uh, Walwyn is on. Here he goes once more. Brilliantly bold, but he swings it. There's Statics Duo getting in the way and maybe not quite in the way. He's recovering. Are ah, they going back for the second? They are. And uh, the return comes in, but they get two. So Duo bubbled with it slightly and they got two. So the big man looking to heave over the pavilion here. He really wants to hit a big one. Kelly Bowles loops it up. He's swinging and missing the shot in terms of where he wanted it to go. Got the inside edge down to Dow. He really is trying hard. He should be working for the windmill farm. Um, he's really swinging hard here. Here he goes once more. Kelly moves in now. Big swing again. Flatter. Brilliantly bold. He guides it down towards third man and gets a single. So it's going to be Kelly. Youngster looks around. Kelly loops it. He watches it flow to the keeper. Not taken cleanly by Joel Simon, who is Simmons, who is normally very sharp. And uh, Veli is coming on, is he? Veli Maynard is coming on. Dow wants to go off, but Walwin has gone off. Beat him to it. So Veli Maynard, maybe he's going to get a few. Oh. Dow wanted to go off, and so Walwin has come back on. And Veli Newton is back on, is on the field, sorry. It means that he's going to bowl. Immediately comes on, he's going to bowl. So, Sunil Narayan for the Masters is on. Making sure that his shoelaces are tied properly. So, it's going to be Veli Maynard. He looks around his field, makes sure everybody's in position. The big man is going to swing. Veli's going to flight. What's going to happen? Something has to give. He's balled him! Fast ball up! Veli Maynard celebrates. Oh, look at the celebration. Veli Maynard, like as if he's saying, what were you out here doing, guys? Look, as soon as I came on, I just showed you how to do it. Bold. Well, it's going to be Veli Maynard picking up a wicket with his very first ball. And he'll be bowling to Lionel. Here he goes. Moves in now to bowl to Lionel. Good delivery, but pushed into the offside. Mill shadows it, but it's Statics door running across. And they'll settle for one. So one more to the total. Here he goes now. Veli Maynard moves in now to bowl. He's driving the youngster. He doesn't have the power, but he certainly has the shots. He goes, moves in once more. Balls. He's choking it again. Off and running. That's brilliant cricket. The youngster driving and running with the shot. That's lovely cricket. <laughs> so here's Veli Maynard to bowl now to Lionel. 
Pose flatter Lionel solidly forward. Coming right in line and just oh misfielded by Mills. Junior Mills going down and not picking it up. Recovers quickly. So here's Maynard moving in now to bowl to Lionel. Lionel is struck on the pad. Loud shout by Billy Maynard. Umpire says not out. So it's Elroy Kelly moving in now to bowl. And a swing and a miss. Um, the youngster trying to heave. Poor line says Curtis Static Store needs to get it. That's better. That's better. Comes on the front foot, pushes it into the offside. Venrick Newton is in the frame, picks it up, gets it to Kelly. Kelly once more moves in now to bold. Off target. Is Static Store going to pull that in? Is Static Store? No. Gets a good bounce in the end. And they're looking for the second run. For one moment, I thought he might have dived. Venue. Well, they got a single. That brings Lionel back into strike. So Lionel settles. Kelly moves in now. He's pushing it into the offside. Ben Newton is right there. Stops it nicely. So Kelly moves in once more. Loops it. He's swinging. He doesn't. Well, well done by Veli Maynard. Oh, sharp looking Veli Maynard. That's short mid wicket. Stops it nicely. Well done, Veli boy. Here goes once more. Kelly moves in now to flatter. He dragged it down, punched into the offside. The man is deep on the extra cover boundary. Picks it up. They're thinking of two. The youngster wants two. And. Uh, they change their minds that ends the over. So he's going to be Maynard and he'll be bowling to Lionel. Got a wicket with his very first delivery. Would want to start the same way as he moves in now to bowl. Good delivery. Well played by Lionel. Quietly pushing it into the offside. Can't score. So it's Maynard once more. Moves in now to bowl to Lionel. Now Lionel is having a heave at that and dragged it into his boot. But he certainly went after that. So here he goes once more. Moves in now to bowl. And that's a wide. So. When Rick asks him Veli if he's tired with that wide. Here he goes once more. Veli Maynard moves in. That's a better delivery. Heave. Oh, that's gone. That's gone. Tactic store is good, but not that good. It's gone for six. Tactic store was leaping in the air. And uh, it's gone for six. Here he goes once more. Veli Maynard moves in now to bowl to. Bold! Oh, what a comeback by Veli Maynard. He's going to give him some talk as well. He walks down to give him the official send-off. That one kept a bit low. Lionel was trying to punch it and gets an official hand arm send-off from Venric Newton. Venri, uh, Veli Maynard, sorry. And that's the second wicket for Veli Maynard. So Veli Maynard it is, and he'll be bowling now to Ward. Here's Maynard moving in now to bowl to Ward. Flat. Beaten outside the off -term. Simmons doesn't collect cleanly. Here goes once more. Maynard moves in now to bowl. He's swinging. It. Oh, the bail's off. But I think his back foot is grounded. And that ends the over. New bowler, L.Y. Kelly is out of the attack. The youngster is um, batting. L.Y. Kelly has been pulled in from the deep extra cover boundary within the circle. So, new bowler. Moves in now to bowl. He's punching it. Ben Newton is across quickly, feels it nicely. Well stopped. So, Venrick Newton, one who enjoys his fielding, 
along with Tactic Store, two of the better fielders you'll find there. Off and running hesitation. This could be interesting. Well, he gets home. So that brings Ward into strike. Let's see. He moves in now to ball. There he goes. Balls to Ward. Ward is driving. That's a lovely looking shot on the front foot. Down to Marshall. Marshall gets behind it. He's going to underarm his return. He doesn't have a strong arm. But they don't look for the second. So one run to the total. So the youngster has been there for a while. He is certainly difficult to get out. And uh, it goes across the bowler. Knocks it away. But um, he's in control. Can't score. So here he goes once more. Moves in now to bowl to the youngster. He's again very stodgy, very hard to get out, I could tell you. He knows how to defend those tree stumps, those tree sticks there. Here he goes once more. Moves in now to bowl. He's driving back up the strip to the bowler. Can't score, but he can't get the wicket either. That ends the over. So it's going to be Maynard as umpire Johnson. Gets to his position. Ward in strike. Main add it is. Moves in now. To bowl to Ward. There's Ward swinging back to Veli Maynard. He drops it. Now that continues what happened, what, two weeks ago when Veli Maynard dropped about three catches. So that's just another one. Ben, I think Veli says he was looking for the ball. The ball came right back at him. Well... So he has dropped it. So it's going to be Veli Maynard moves in now to bowl to the youngster. He's watching it outside the off stump. Well taken by Simmons. So it's going to be Simmons once more. Sorry, Veli Maynard once more. Moving in now to bowl. Loops it up. The oh, he's driving. He's off and running again. Tactic store is there. But he can't prevent a single. And uh, one more to the total. Here goes once more. Veli Maynard bowls to Ward. Ward is beaten outside the off stump. Seemed very uncertain there. Looks as if he wanted to come into the front foot belatedly on the back foot. By the time he was completing the shot, the ball was through to the keeper. Here's Maynard. That was a flatter delivery. I think he's going to loop one now. The flatters two is beaten. He has a wild swing at that. Well taken by the keeper. I think the off stump moved. So here goes once more. Ward moving in now to bowl to that may he bowled him. He has bowled him. Veli Maynard has bowled him. And that's wicket number three for Maynard. So free for Marshall. Free for Veli Maynard. As Ward went for the big heave. And he's bowled neck and crop. There he goes, moves in now to bowl. He's turning it nicely. Here's um, Tatics. No, he doesn't. I don't think Tatics want to run them out. There's something about the way Tatics collected that. And I think if it was a more senior player, I think you would have seen something different. So, one run to the total. The youngsters willing to run. Here he goes, bowls. Solidly in line. These youngsters have learned their craft. They have learned to play orthodox cricket. And that's good at this age. You love to see them play like that. They're not going to score a lot of runs. But they're going to score runs. But not a lot of it. They're not going to have the big shots. But um, definitely they can play the shots in, um, offside and onside. Get the singles. Maybe a couple of twos as well. And this particular youngster, I saw him slug sweep last um, two weeks ago, I think, for four. So he has the ability to slug sweep. He's driving at that. He's off and running. Mills says, OK, I'm going to let you have it. And an easy single down to mid on. So I think the fat lady really is singing at the boundary's edge. But the youngsters will have a little. Oh, that's a short ball and wide signal by the umpire. Here he goes once more. Moves in now to bowl. He's whoa, right across his stumps. Very ambitious shot indeed. 
went right across his off stump and took that one right off middle and uh, back out of square tactics do is there but they get a single ambitious shot that here he goes now bows that's a wide awful delivery that well taken by simmons moving across nicely to pull it in with both gloves so here he goes once more moves in now to bowl he's punching it looking for the single but straight back up the strip to the bowler that ends the over i think that's the game so that's the game so masters would have won game number three so two and one is the tally as masters would celebrate another victory as they prepare for the big tournament on the mountain well that's our package for this evening and indeed for the week i am curtis morton reminding you that you can watch sports if you're not fit but to play sports requires fitness diligence and sacrifice have a good night and a great weekend